going guys, try on a gaming here. And a uh, quick thing about the gameplay, look at that awesome MP7. Art of War is probably the best camo for that gun, just look how good it looks. Also when I aim in it looks gangster as hell. Um, don't want to talk about the gameplay at all, I just, as you've seen by the title probably you know what I'm going to talk about. How and just, you probably think it's another rant about new Call of Duties and all that. It kind of is. I'll be honest. Um, when I played COD 4, it felt like the best Call of Duty just because it didn't have all the extra access shit added to it that a modern day Call of Duty does. But, I mean, Modern Warfare 3 had specials and support. I like specials. Specials was pretty cool. Um, support, terrible. Who wanted that? Nobody wanted support added to any class. No, unless you suck so bad at the game that you need to get, earn rewards for dying between kills. That's terrible. I I probably use support once in a while, yeah. But I remember trying to get a support in Juggernaut and it felt like the stupidest thing ever because I got it one fourth through the match. It, who who does that really? And it was in Team Defender, so imagine getting one in Team Defender or Domination where you can just sit there taking the flags and getting shot and it doesn't matter. You're not gonna die. But so far, Black Ops seems really good. Black Ops 2 seems like one of the best Call of Duty so far. They actually put thought into it instead of, you know, not trying at all. I don't want to say Infinity War didn't do this, but it's true. Modern Warfare 3 seemed like it was made in one-fourth of the time that they had to make it. I picked up that gun for no reason. Don't know why. But, uh, and it, it COD 4 actually had time put into it because it was the first, like, massive multiplayer kind one. That, it, to me, it was the first multiplayer in general, because I didn't play the first three. Um, and they kind of just screwed Modern Warfare 3 over. I put my most gaming time into Modern Warfare 3, and I feel bad I did. I wish I put all my gaming time into Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops and COD 4, because those were all awesome games. Better than Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3 is terrible. It, it really, I mean, I'm sorry if you really like Mario 3. I liked Mario 3, I'll be honest. I mean, I played all the time with my friends. And it brought back, like, tons of memories to actually... Because, like, I think yesterday, one of my friends who does have Black Ops 2, uh, I got on play Mario 3. Quick kill confirmed with him. Yeah, that felt so, like, it felt like bringing back, basically, memories. But it didn't feel good as a game itself because of how all the mess-ups they did. I mean, I lagged. I have good connection, I'll be, uh, like, you'll see in this gameplay, because it's not from theater mode. I have good connection. I have, you know, good enough connection to kill people. I've never lagged in any game, like, so bad that I have to stop playing and just wait. Except for Mario 4 3. I had to stop playing Mario 4 3 for a straight week because how bad it lagged. I went, black, I went to Black Ops, played it, no lag at all. I didn't lag at all. What I think it was was that thing, I think it's lag comp, where lag compensation where they make if you're host you lag a lot or something something stupid that they didn't need to do <laughs> it was idiotic and I don't know if that's in this game or not I really don't care I haven't been lagging in this game so it doesn't matter um and gun balancing COD 4 had the most balanced gun really MP5 was pretty good and powerful gun you know uh probably the most powerful um, this game, uh, all the SMGs are pretty powerful, hip firing, you know, you're gonna hit them. It's just gonna happen. And, um, it, but COD 4 seemed like the most balanced. Warfare 2 is pretty balanced, actually, it's just noob tubes were too powerful. Um, what it were. Remember the MP40, that gun that pissed you off when you died? It was a one shot to the head, I think a three shot to the body, two sometimes. And it had, like, with ex the extended mags attachment thing, you had 62 bullets, which is more than most of the, like, machine guns. I think one had 100. It might have just been called Type 100. I don't remember too well, because I don't play Mario or, or World at War very much. And, it, why? Why do you need a gun that has more bullets than an S or um, a light machine gun? It, it uh, kills faster than a semi-automatic gun, and it's fully automatic. Well, and it was, you could hit fire with it across the map worse than, like in this game people, people hate hit fire because you can fire across maps with a laser sight and kill a sniper for it, it gets, but, and that was the same deal in World at War, um, yeah they probably should nerf the SMGs, I don't hit fire very much in this video actually, in the gameplay, 
And one of the best things about uh, COD 4, I love this, I played this game so much time just for fun, was the game where they gave you a pistol and you had to run around finding guns like, uh, no, they gave you a scorpion, and you had to run around finding guns like the M14 and all, and, or MK14, whichever one it was, and then had to kill them like that. That was so fun, why don't they bring that back? The maps in COD 4 were awesome, I loved all of them. I want shipment. When I was hoping they'd do in Black Ops 2 was take, um, Matt from, uh, World Order and put him in this. That'd be so cool. Nuketown 2025 was cool, though, even though I don't have it because it broke him. If you don't know, uh, you know how if you try to get into a game that you don't have the content, it'll say this content has been broken or lost or hasn't been purchased. Yeah, that keeps coming up and saying that I broke my content. I don't know how I broke my content. I don't care either. Uh... What else? What is... Uh, what, there's nothing really you need to explain about how bad Modern Warfare 3 is. I, I don't I keep hitting Modern Warfare 3 just just because I didn't like the... It was a terribly put together game. But it... It was the worst. Modern Warfare 2 was probably one of the best. COD 4 was the best. Black Ops was good. World at War... I didn't like World at War a lot, but that's my opinion. So World at War and Modern Warfare 3 are the worst Call of Duties. But obviously, Modern Warfare 3 is worse of the two of them, but in my opinion, it would go. Um, right now, Black Ops 2 is at the top, just because I love Black Ops 2. I've been playing so much. Then COD 4. Then Modern Warfare 2. Then, but I don't know, I don't know. I, I'm getting off track. Then probably Black Ops, World at War, um, then Modern Warfare 3, which was the worst. I hated Modern Warfare 3. Thanks for watching, guys. Here's the final kill count to prove I didn't do it in theater mode. Thanks for watching and just listening to what I have to say about how I want another COD 4. The next Call of Duty better be like COD 4. I'm going to have issues. Like this video. Show some support for the channel. Subscribe if you don't want to miss any more. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys later. Try signing out.